good afternoon dear students so today's class let us discuss about the preparations of alcohols by addition of grignard reagent to aldehydes and ketones so as you know that so what is the formula for the grignard reagent as you know that the general formula for the grignard reagent is r m z x in hello alkanes and hello arenes chapter already you know that so r m g x is alkyl magnesium halide so already we have prepared the alkyl magnesium halide that is called as grignard reagent so here yeah, in grignard reagent that alkyl group is acts as electronegative that is polarity of alkyl group is electronegative and polarity of magnesium is electropositive and polarity of halogen is electronegative as you know that already so based on this polarity charges so we can add this grignard, grignard reagent to aldehydes and ketones and we can obtain some corresponding alcohols so now let us take some important methods of preparations of alcohols by addition of grignard reagent to corresponding aldehydes and corresponding ketones so i will take one example so now i will consider one example so any aldehyde or ketone so i will consider one carbonyl group to that if you add rmgx that is alkyl magnesium halide is also called as grignard reagent in presence of dry ether in presence of dry ether the addition of alkyl group takes place to the partially positive carbon atom this is partially negative as you know that in structure of carbonyl group carbon is acts as partially positive in nature oxygen is acts as partially polarity is negative in nature so when this alkyl group when this alkyl group is substituted to this carbon atom so this will considered as carbon here is addition of alkyl group can take place as r we can add the alkyl group to this carbon atom and remaining is oxygen oxygen and uh, this oxygen is electronegative in nature so this electropositive magnesium will attract to this oxygen atom so o m z x will form so here this is the addition reaction the addition of alkyl group and addition of magnesium halide to this oxygen atom so that's that leads to the formation of addition product this is nothing but addition product this is addition product so further this addition product which undergo acid hydrolysis so which when undergo acid hydrolysis so acid hydrolysis means so addition of acid with presence of water so which when undergo acid hydrolysis that leads to the formation of corresponding alcohols so here carbon here alkyl group here while adding oh group so that is called as acidic hydrolysis anta helabodu na illi acid hydrolysis anta helthivi so what happens here here oxygen and hydrogen so hydrogen will attack to this oxygen this is delta negative this is delta positive so this when which one undergo cleavage when we add acid when we done the method of acid hydrolysis this undergo cleavage and this h plus ion will attack to this oxygen atom that forms oh and uh, remaining one more oh group will attack to this magnesium oh another oh is electro negative so that's why plus here remaining is mg oh here x so this is called alcohol this is called alcohol this is nothing but basic magnesium compound this is basic magnesium compound anta helabodu basic magnesium compound so this is the method of preparation of alcohol from any aldehydes or ketones so generally let us take one example for this aldehyde that is formaldehyde so dear students so this is a general method of preparation of alcohol let us consider the some suitable aldehydes and suitable ketones to bring about some corresponding alcohols and corresponding 
ketones by taking corresponding ketones we can also obtain some corresponding alcohols now let us take one more example for this i thought you have understood about this concept next i will go for one more example here i will take formaldehyde so this is the molecule is now formaldehyde or aldehyde generally we can take aldehyde aldehyde is the molecule when this aldehyde is undergo reacts with rmgx so that leads to the formation of addition of alkyl group takes place to this carbon this is r this is h addition of alkyl group to this carbon atom remaining is oxygen and mgx same further which undergo acid hydrolysis that leads to the formation of similar er or er hydrogen so this gives an corresponding alcohol so this is basic magnesium compound that is as it is as is well similarly now let us consider one more example for this aldehyde for aldehyde example is formaldehyde aldehyde general formula for the aldehyde is rcho next further if you consider one more suitable example for this aldehyde is formaldehyde if you consider instead of this r if you consider hydrogen this molecule is called as formaldehyde now we can consider this molecule is called as formaldehyde this molecule is called as formaldehyde this is called formaldehyde so for this formaldehyde when we add a grignard reagent same method so first we have to add this alkyl group to this carbon atom why because this is electronegative in polar so this is electronegative polar group will attack to this electropositive polar group so this will attack here so this will what is going to be changes here hydrogen is there instead of alkyl group it is consider hydrogen 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 addition of alkyl group addition of alkyl group this oxygen is attacked by mgx mgx will attack to this oxygen atom so here oxygen is there mgx is attacked this is called as addition product further what happens this addition product which undergo acid hydrolysis further this acid hydrolysis that leads to the formation of here hydrogen r is replaced by only hydrogen this is r is replaced by only hydrogen so what happens this is the molecule is called as acid hydrolysis after that we are going to get an alcohol so what is the general alcohol it is so if you consider any further molecule instead of rmgx if you consider cs3mgx so we can able to assign the name of this alcohol so due to presence of alkyl group generally we can name it as only alcohol so next remaining left out is mgohx this is called basic magnesium compound same so for the another molecule this is formaldehyde you can take acetaldehyde acetaldehyde what is the formula for the acetaldehyde this for this if you consider here ch3 this is a molecule is called as acetaldehyde this is a molecule is called as acetaldehyde the addition of grignard reagent to this acetaldehyde what happens when we add this alkyl group so same procedure will continue instead of h here we have, you have to write hydrogen so here h is there instead of h ch3 now it becomes acetaldehyde for the molecule it becomes acetaldehyde we have to take ch3cho is called acetaldehyde that's why ch3cho here also ch3cho so addition of alkyl group is takes place and this oxygen one one pair of electron will shifted on this oxygen atom this gets electronegative then this magnesium is electropositive this will attack to this oxygen atom so that forms mgx will attack to this oxygen atom mgx further which undergo this is called addition product further which undergo acid hydrolysis that leads to the formation of here instead of h here we have to write cs3 cs3 and this is called as alcohol alcohol is substituted to this carbon atom this is called as aliphatic alcohol so this is the remaining left out is mgx and here one oh that is basic magnesium compound will form okay similarly one more example you may consider that is acetone these are all about the aldehydes these are all the examples for the aldehydes so you can take examples for ketones ketone what is the general formula for the ketone so r c double bond o r this is the molecule is called as ketone either side you must write alkyl groups so that's why c double bond o here you must write general formula for the ketone is r here also r r c double bond o r is the general formula for the ketone so the addition of grignard reagent to the ketone so either you may prepare alcohols by the addition of grignard reagent to aldehydes or 
ketone to anyone you may add grignard reagent you will get the corresponding alcohols only so this is the molecule is called as ketone here same process the addition of alkyl group and further addition of mzx to this oxygen so when we add this alkyl group this pi bond is going to be cleavage and this one lone pair of electrons will shift over on the oxygen atom this gets a higher electron density so that immediately this electropositive metal ion metal ion will attack to this oxygen atom so it will make a bond with oxygen and magnesium so here we are observing oxygen is bonding with magnesium so mzx will directly attack to this oxygen atom so after addition of this alkyl group next mzx will attack so same process here instead of h and ch3 we are right r here also r why because here the group is r and r this is ketone molecule so further here also we have to replace by r here also r so this is called as alcohol for this ketone also from this ketone also we can prepare some respected alcohols the left out is basic magnesium compound same for this general formula for the ketone let us consider one suitable example for the ketone so for suitable example is r is replaced by ch3 okay here also r is replaced by ch3 same addition process will take place and same kinds of compounds we're going to get so instead of r you have to replace ch3 only that is only the trick so first reaction if you understand clearly then you can able to easily write so many number of addition of grignard reagent to the many types of aldehydes and ketones okay here this is the formula what we have to change here this is uh, rmgx is same here cs3 cs3 is there here we have to write cs3 and cs3 cs3 and cs3 that's all here also ch3 and cs3 very simple cs3 cs3 same this is called as alcohol so we can able to prepare alcohols by addition of grignard reagent to aldehydes and also as well as to the ketones so by addition of this grignard reagent to both aldehydes and ketones we can able to obtain such kind of alcohols okay dear students so this is about the complete preparations of alcohols and uh, next class let us going to be discuss about the preparations of phenols so that is very very important for the point of examination thank you